Hello everyone. Welcome back to another session of Selenium training. In this session, we are going to see how to upload a file or how to download a file. So this is very easy concept. So uploading is just uh, like uploading any file from your local system to uh, the web page or downloading means downloading a file from any web page. Okay, like it's a profile photo upload or downloading anything like that. So this file upload is easy, but file download sometimes you might face challenge based on your browser, based on your operating system and based on your uh, operating system version as well. So we will see how to uh, handle this file upload and how to handle this file download. So in the first session, we'll be dealing with file upload and in the next part, we will be dealing with file download. Okay, for now, let's see how to uh, perform an file upload. Okay. So let me create a new class here. New class file upload example. Okay, so let me write static void main. Okay, so let me take the system dot set property all these by handy. So for validating this, we have one portal. So go to this link. I'll be giving it in the description box and type upload. So you'll be seeing this file upload and directly I'll be taking this link and driver dot navigate dot to. Okay. Now I have to click on this choose file. So and I have to click on this download right but if you click on this choose file you will be seeing some window this is a different window right this is a desktop window and not a web ba web based window so how to handle these things so file upload is very simple you don't have to inspect or of course you can handle this with auto it and robot but there is a simple method which is common with less coding so we'll see that and after choosing a file you have to click on upload once you click on upload so what we are going to do is i already have some file under document files test so i'll be uploading this file and i'll click on upload and i will get a text message that uh, file uploaded and also the file which i uploaded we will validate we will check for file uploaded text and see whether file upload is successful or not okay so to do that so generally you have to inspect this file first sorry inspect this button so let us go and inspect this button so it's an input tag so let's write an xpath for that input at the rate id is equal to file iphone upload okay so we got a unique th text okay let us store this in some web element okay web element upload button is equal to driver dot find element of by dot xpath of xpath expression just save this okay and import this web element okay now what you simply have to do is you don't have to click here that is the tricky concept here you don't have to click here you directly can send the send, send the path of your file because internally whenever you do this upload button dot send keys off internally the browser will understand that it's a button for uploading a file and internally it will operate to send the file that we are about to send so give upload button dot send keys off so go to your path where you placed your file so document files so copy this link and give your file name it's test right so test dot txt okay now we are done with sending keys why we have to use send keys once you click here you have to send your path here right so something like this c colon slash right everything so you have to send the path that's the reason we are using send keys here so once the send keys is done what is our next step we have to click on this upload button so inspect this element also you can see the id of it is file submit so use this here 
and get the X path. So we have X path now. So once we send the keys, we will just click on that button, right? Driver dot find element of by dot X path of submit button dot click. We just have to click this button, upload button, right? So once we click on upload button, what we have to do? So let's execute till here and see how it works. Okay. So let me close this browser and let me run this. See browser is launched. and it's navigating to that upload page yeah see you can see now it's uploaded successfully but we have to verify whether this file uploaded text is visible or not we need to have some confirmation right so we have to validate this text also and based on that we can pass our test saying that file upload is successful right so to validate this text just inspect this element okay and then inspect this you can see this is in h3 tag that mean you have to get this using inner html or you can first write the x path okay slash double slash give star or you can give h3 text is equal to what is the text copy exact text without any spaces and errors done we got the x path now we have to verify whether this x path is present or not that means whether we are not verifying the text exactly but we are verifying whether this file upload is present or not okay so to do that you have to write that in if condition so i will write if driver dot find element of by dot x path of x path expression okay so dot is displayed of so this is displayed will is a boolean function which will tell us whether the uh, element is present or not that means whether this file uploaded text is present or not so if it is present then i'll print file upload is successful else else i'll print file upload is not successful sorry file upload is not successful okay so that's all we have so this is the end of the code okay we are just going to verify whether this text is present or not else will it will display the message okay so let me format this in nice way Control shift f will format your code now let us run this program and see whether we are get it, getting the correct text or not okay so let me bring it down yes this also so let's run it now So it's launching the web page. Yes, it's uploaded. And now you can see file upload is successful because it's we have to do some verification for each and every test. So for file upload, we have to check for the confirmation messages. So those are called confirmation messages. You have to for sure verify that to check whether it is uploaded or not. Simply uploading is not enough. You have to verify and pass the test, right? So this is one test that we are doing here so this is about file upload so in the next upcoming session uh, we'll see how to download a file and um, yeah thanks for watching this video and if you have any suggestions and feedback just please leave a comment in the description or you can uh, give any suggestions and feedback in the comments thank you and have a nice day